hundreds of pieces of mail stolen from mailboxes in the suburbs. Tonight, investigators say three suspects are in custody after a police chase. And our Jennifer Lee is in Haverford Township. Jennifer, this is alarming, obviously, and a lot of us are now sending out our holiday cards and presents, making it even more disconcerting. Yes, it is, it, that's exactly right. We talked to a lot of people at the post office about these mail thefts, and you could get a sense of their paranoia about sending anything of value in the mail. The post office and mailboxes see a lot of action during the holidays. Sending holiday cards and uh, shipping to loved ones. But Haverford Township Police say hundreds of pieces of mail, including bills and Christmas cards, were never delivered but stolen. That's terrible because people love to give and people love to receive. And to have that happen is just terrible all around. In the early morning hours of December 15th, an officer saw a person at a mailbox on Darby Road who ran into the passenger side of a black Dodge Charger. Due to recent mail thefts, the officer tried to investigate, but the car took off at high speeds. Police say during the chase, mail was being thrown out of the car until it crashed here on Karakung Drive. One was arrested on the spot, and two others ran on foot, but were eventually arrested. It's not a local offense, stealing mail. It's a federal offense. That's big time if you get caught. 18-year-old Tyrese English and 22-year-old Amir Johnson, both of Philadelphia, and 19-year-old Aloysius Kickmit of Upper Darby were arrested. Police recovered a handgun and two USPS bins of mail from the car. For safety reasons, I put it in that box right there because it goes right into the mailbox, right into the post office, rather. I also bought an anti-fraud pen uh, at Staples for any checks. I try not to write many checks, but if I have to. Yes, we talked with a lot of people who are just being extra careful with their mail. Now we're told that bail has been set at 250 grand. Police continue their investigation into the mail thefts and say if you have any information, make sure you come forward. Live at Haverford Township Police Department, Jennifer Lee, Fox 29 News. All right, Jennifer, good thing they caught the alleged thieves. Thank you.